Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Tony Lopez. And I'm Sharon Roger. We start with violence on a local elementary school playground. A 14 year old girl in the hospital recovering, her 13 year old classmate with a knife under arrest. This all played out just before 1 30 at Rio Calaveras Elementary School in Stockton. CBS 13 Steve Large is live in San Joaquin County with this scary schoolyard attack. Steve? Thankfully, this 14 year old girl is going to be okay. She was rushed here to the San Joaquin County General Hospital with non life threatening injuries. That classmate is now facing an attempted murder charge. A school playground turned crime scene. The suspect and victim, both students, a 14 year old girl stabbed at Stockton's Rio Calaveras Elementary, a K 8 school. Police say the weapon used was a fixed blade knife. A 13 year old boy and classmate snuck onto campus. Just worried, scared. Wanting to cry. Teresa Patron is a mother of two children at Rio Calaveras Elementary. I didn't know how severe it was. She received a call on her cell phone from the Stockton Unified School District with a recorded message alerting her about the incident. Besides the shock, she is satisfied with how the school handled notifying parents. You know, we got notified right away. They said it happened at 1:20. We were notified by like 1:45. Other families picking their children up say they'd like to know more. I wonder what happened. What, what caused all that? Why did that kid bring the knife to school? They do need to check them coming through the gate. They need to do that. Even at this young of an age? At this young of an age. Neither the district or police have released details about what led up to this stabbing. Stockton Unified issued a statement reading in part, we take this incident seriously. Our district crisis response team will be on campus to respond to the emotional needs of our students and staff. The school district recently changed campus security policies at Rio Calaveras Elementary, closing the campus to parents unless they sign in and have previously submitted fingerprints. But, you know, today it was a student, so it was just makes us worried. Violent crime at a K through eight, a playground stabbing, leaving parents concerned, police investigating. And by the way, two security guards were on the campus at the time of this stabbing that there was no police uh, resource officer that is assigned to this school. At least they were not on this particular day. Again, thankfully, that 14 year old girl is going to be okay.